Hey everyone, I'm Aaron. I'm Paisley. And I'm Nicole. And welcome to our channel. If you're new here, we're super glad you're checking us out. We'd love it if you would consider subscribing to our channel. And if you are already subscribed, thank you so much. So today we're gonna do something a little bit different. We are really excited because it's almost Christmas. And what are we gonna go do today? We're gonna get a tree. That's right. So even though we live in Arizona and most of the time people think all we have are cactus. cactus. <laughs> <laughs> there are several tree lots here located in town, so we're going to go out and pick out a real tree. It was something we started a couple years ago. We were doing the fake trees, but just having that real tree in the house gives a total different experience. And the smell of Christmas. Mm -hmm. So we hope everyone is having a great holiday season thus far. We will see you at the tree lot. So we made it. We're here at the Buckaloo Farms local tree stand. They've got several of them dotted all over Tucson and we're hoping to be able to go in there and find this year's family tree. I'm so excited. What kind of tree are you? Are you a real tree or a fake tree? And either way, what style do you like? Personally, we are fans of fir trees, but let us know in the comments below what's your favorite kind of tree whenever you either go shopping for a Christmas tree or you have your fake tree at home. Enough talk, now let's go look for a tree. Yay. Lot of work but the tree turned out beautiful it was definitely worth it let us know in the comments because we're really curious are you like us and your tree is kind of made up of various ornaments with personal touches to them or are you someone who has to have everything color coordinated with the garland and ribbon and all the other things we like the hodgepodge approach we figure once we have no kids in the house, we can go ahead and make ourselves a catalog perfect tree, maybe, but until then, it's really fun to put up the different things, um, commemorating first Christmases, first Christmases together, and just the different years that we've celebrated Christmas together. And some ballet ornaments. Right, because Little Miss Paisley loves her some dance. Yes. And we know that 2020 has been a year for the record books and Hopefully 2021 brings about change and improvement for all of us across the world. But no matter what you're doing, who you're celebrating with, from the bottom of our hearts, we wanna wish you and yours a very, very Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. Have a safe Christmas and Happy New Year. Merry Christmas. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye.